Okay, in this uh, video, I'm going to briefly look at submitting work through the phone app um, for Microsoft Teams. First, um, a kind of consistent problem is images not being cropped properly. Um, first of all, I suppose you have to make sure that you've got good light and that your phone is above um, the page that you're taking a photo of and then it's important as well to uh, have a look at the image and to crop it properly so if you're not familiar with cropping an image uh, one or two people might not be um, if you go into photos and we'll take let's say this image here and um, if you go up here to the edit button up here in the corner press that um, and now I want to go down here to the rotate and crop button, which is just down here at the bottom. I'm gonna press on that, and now I have the option to crop it. So again, just with your finger up to the line, bring it down to the edge of the page, make sure not to cut anything out. And uh, I'm gonna bring it up here a little bit as well. That way the text will be bigger. So again, I've just put my finger on the white line down here. I'm moving it up and down. So I'm moving it there. And when I'm happy with that, I'll go down here to done in the corner and my images is ready to go. Okay, uh, so that's quite important as well in terms of your teacher being able to, to read your work uh, properly. Um, so we go into Microsoft Teams into the app then. Um, and you see your menu down here at the bottom. So you have two ways of accessing your assignment. Uh, one is in the assignments tab itself and uh, a few uh, assignments here um so you can see that are overdue so if i um go into this one here and um what's important here to pay attention to are this tab here add work and this tab up here hand in late or hand in it should be um so if you want to attach work the thing to do is um up here to Add work that you want to submit for your assignment and then you've got you've got different options one is if you have and I would recommend this you to have the um, office app the Microsoft office app which includes kind of PowerPoint and Word and all those things and, and even um, OneNote in it or OneDrive in it um, in have it installed on your phone as well and that would be that would be a big help um, so anytime you make a document then in that office app it'll be saved to your OneDrive so you can go into your OneDrive and you can decide what you want to uh, attach so for example if I wanted to pick this uh, document here let's say my homework is in here I had it called say history homework page 20, 25 27 I can just press on that and uh, it will be attached there okay and if I wanted at that point I can uh, I can press hand in or hand in late up here in the corner. Um, but I'm actually going to attach some images in this case. So if I want to, if I've attached the wrong thing, I can just press the three dots over here and remove. So I'll go back over here to add work um, again. And this time I'm going to go to upload from this device. So I can take photos, so you can take it live, but better to have it taken already so you can have it cropped and ready to go and uh, go into your photo library and you'll see your different images so I've just gone in there to um, all photos see some of my kids work there and uh, here's the image I just recently cropped um, yeah that's it right there so you can see it's blue boxes is ticked there on that and uh, if there's a second one I want to Press on this one here as well. Okay, and then I'm gonna press uh, done. And you can see that they're um, they're uploading there. Occasionally you might have a problem with adding more than one photo, particularly on Android. If that's the case, upload one, come out, then press add work again, go in and pick another one and come in and, and, and go back and forth like that. And it'll still work fine. Um, so now I'm happy I've got the two images for my homework um, added and they're cropped it'll be easy for the teacher to see and to correct properly and uh, so now I can go up here to the corner to hand in or in this case because it's it's not a real account uh, and it's overdue it's hand in late and I press that and work is handed in 
again you get that that um animated kind of graphic then to show you've handed it in if you realize you made a mistake or afterwards or there's a problem you can undo that as well okay so that's just how to hand in an assignment using your phone and particularly obviously you're going to be using your phone if you're taking photos of your work to upload it and uh, by following that and doing it properly um, it makes it much much simpler uh, for your teacher to see your work properly and, and correct it properly as well and uh, just be conscious that photos are the right way up and that they're well taken in good light and that they're they're well they're properly cropped and then your your work in doing the homework won't have kind of gone to waste